Welcome back, guys. We're gonna take the letter Bob. Bob. As an equivalent in English is the D or people might refer to it with DH, which means like a double D, let's say. It's a strong D. Okay? It's called Bob. Why this letter is so important is because this is the letter that identify or refers to the Arabic language. So we say that the language of Bab, that means that Arabic is the only tongue who pronounce this letter, Bab, okay? For example, like in, uh, I don't know, Espanol, they got the uh, letter, you know, as an identification for their language, let's say. Exactly the same here. In Arabic, we have the Bab as the index uh, or the key letter that we have referring to the Arabic language. So let's go for the uh, forms or the shapes. The isolated one is like that. The initial one is like that. The medial one is like that. And the final one is like that. Okay, now I made a mistake. Do you remember guys, what is this now? Exactly. This is Saab. And if I would just place a dot on the top of it, it's gonna be Bob, you know? So this is pretty much it. I mean, this is the beauty of this language that the shapes are quite the same with just a difference, a little bit of a different, dif the, uh, a little bit, with difference, you know, between the uh, dot location, it just has different total sound. So, as I said before, the previous lesson was about sob. Now, if we put the dot on the top, it's become bod. Okay, I'm gonna wipe this out. I'm gonna go for the pronunciation. As I said, unfortunately, it is there are. There is no pronunciation like in other language because this is like Arabic language specific letter. Uh, all what I could say, it just could be like a strong D. For example, uh, I could say uh, an example, day, okay, like the word, let's say day. And imagine I would just say it with double D, a huge D. Day, you know, day, normal, day, day, you know. I'm gonna give you an example in that. I'm gonna give you an example for that in Arabic. The word dahik. This is a dot, okay? Dahik. Which means laughter. Okay. Bahik. So the difference is it is not the word, you know, dahik. It is not, okay? Otherwise, it's not even existed, you know? The difference is if I use the D or the Dal at the beginning, it is Dahik. You know, if I use this Dad, it will be Dahik. I'm trying to make it a bit uh, clearer. I hope I'm, you guys are getting me well. I'm doing my best here. Dahik and Dahik. Dahik. Bohik, you see? So, which means laughter. 
I hope it was clear. If you have guys any questions, please feel free to ask me. Thank you so much.